Hey, what's up guys? This is Eisenheim reporting. Okay, I'm gonna show you um, <clears throat> how my low mount still works when it comes to traffic lights. Here you go. So here's the first one. There you go. So the MPC appears. So most of the traffic lights, traffic lights that I encounter it's just almost the same thing. Just to prove that um, you know low mount still works, you know. Here's another one. Probably this one. Is okay, that's not. Will I be testing long? I mean, experimental. Uh, for me, not in the foreseeable future. Um, I don't like to test. I don't like to test long. Okay, um, I get anxiety. I don't like it. I would rather test lateral. But long, I want you know. I want to keep my stop wash. There you go. There's another red light. There you go. Yeah, I want to keep my... Yeah, I don't like... Because I've been... You know, I tested Bowak before. You know, um, I, I don't like the feeling. Um, get, um, I just don't like it. Um, I'll just wait till it becomes prime time. You know what I'm saying? Until it's ready for daily use. Um, for my accord, okay? Some cars, I think it's good. But some cars don't. Okay, so that's the difference. Uh, this is Accord, so I haven't seen any videos with Vovok yet. You know what I'm saying? So, and and I love the coasting on my Bosch ACC. I really love the coasting. So, if there's no coasting on Vovok, it's a deal breaker. So I don't mind having not to have. Uh, not to have um, traffic lights or stop sign because you know my car is low torque anyway so and also I I treat my car as an advanced ADAS the open pilot as event I don't even treat it as self-driving so I'm not losing sleep if I don't have traffic lights okay this one it's a red and there's another red on the on, on the left side so you know what I'm saying so you can see it's like I, I think it got confused Red and green. I'm not sure, so I don't know about that one. Um, yeah, this is just to show you that it works on low mount, um, and I'll be posting videos on again on my current setup, what to buy, what I, what have you. Okay, I'll be posting it in a few days, or maybe you know in a day or two. Um, because I really like the low mount. Okay. Here's another one. This is a left turn. It works. But the thing is, my car has no torque. No torque at all. So, you know, what's the point? <laughs> but anyway. Um, yeah. Um... You only gonna need to sacrifice it. Uh, the mounting system is a three-part system: two base mount and one attaching center mount. Uh, you need you're gonna need uh, two metal plates, super glue. You have to glue us. You have to glue the ba the, uh, the base mount, one of the base mount to the to the grill of the uh, infotainment system. So you have you're gonna sacrifice a, a certain area. With super glue, that's the only way. Okay, that's the only way. Um, if you can find any, you know, it's up to you. Any way to do it with a clamp or something, it's up to you. But for me, I do it super glue. I don't care if that one base mount, you know, it's behind the, it's behind the info. You won't even see it. You know what I'm saying? So it doesn't. If you don't see, if 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 a tree falls in the forest. 
you know what I'm saying? Out of sight, out of mind, basically. Okay. Um, yeah, that's the only way. Unless you have a three D printer, unless you're good in three D printing and have a three D printer. And I've been asking people to, um, you know, make an, a low mount, but nobody, you know, no one, no, no one is a taker on that one. So, so I decided to make it my own, even it's a dirty, even it's a dirty, um, even it's a poorly, you know, dirty hack. I just want my low mount, okay? Um, and when you look at my channel, I'm like mounting it everywhere, okay? For the last two years, I've been testing mounts from left to right, center or whatever. That's my thing. Um, you know, um, and it works. <laughs> it works. Basically, open pilot. The, the it's it's, it's vision based. Basically, all it needs is to be pointing straight to the road. Okay. The only reason why Kama wants you to have it center is um, because center is the one because the windshield curves from the center. Okay. You cannot you cannot attach it anywhere else in the windshield. Only the center part, maybe a you know maybe a, uh, a little wiggle room, but other than that, that's the only way. If you don't have an if you don't have an adjustable mount, okay. And another thing is, uh, during summertime, if you um, didn't do the prep the proper preparation for mounting, that is, um, you know. Um, cleaning it with alcohol and leaving it to cure for a few days it will fall off it will start to peel off see that's another concern for me so every time summertime i have to look at the vhb i have to you know it's another concern for me you know saying which with the low mount i don't have to worry about it see the thing it's less to worry you know what i'm saying that's the beauty of low mount it will never fall you know, you know, so, yeah, so, and it's closer to my AC, to the vent. I can cool it, so my comma tree never gets hot at all. So the fan doesn't, you know, the fan doesn't turn on, which in turn makes a quiet drive. Yeah. I know the fan is quieter than the CD or whatever, you, but no fan turning is better than fan turning. Okay, so okay, here's gonna be the last traffic light, left turn. Let's see. I'm gonna go stop. Disappear. Okay, so this one, I don't know, because again, because of the red light, I don't know. So this is 0817, so probably the 9.0 took care of it, okay? It's basically, it's all about testing, guys, you know, so, but anyway, again, this is Eisenheim. Thank you, thank you for following. I just want to show you guys. Uh, it's all about testing. Again, thank you, and thank you for subscribing. Leave a like, and have a happy, safe testing. Bye.